Hello, Bass Ninja family. Uh, today, we're, I'm in St. Augustine, Florida, and I'm gonna be doing some pond hopping today to see how many bass I can catch. Get her done. All right. I've been to this place once before. There's no trespassing signs. Um, so we'll see if we can get on it. I got a little lunker log frog right here. I said lunker log. So we're just going to try to, uh, I'm not going to spend too much time. I'm going to try to pond hop. I'm going to go to a couple different ponds and see what we got here. There's a bass right there. The idea is to try to use the frog. Again, I'm gonna stay here. It doesn't have any no trespassing signs, but. Keeps falling off. I'm not, I'm not sure this place is used to seeing frogs. I mean, I do see a few lily pads, but... Try this. I'm gonna try this point right here. Just do it up in the tree. Just trying to get it on this point. I'm, I don't like going in places I don't know for sure if I can fish, so I'm like a little hesitant. But again, there's no trespassing sign, so. So I'm just gonna try to speed fish. I'm just gonna throw up on the bank and if nothing hits it, then I'm just. I've seen a bass in here. I know there's fish, I've caught one here before. The time that I did come here.
It's the frog challenge. It's so hot today. Yeah, these fish have probably never even seen a frog. I'm throwing it right where they would be. I just don't think they see frogs here much. All right, guys, I was already here, and I don't think I'm going to come back. The frog just wasn't cutting it because I don't think they're used to a frog. So I took this little skirt off this... Off this... Uh, little spinner bait and I put on a raid swimmer I've seen some people use this and have success so we'll see how we do All right, fam, we're at pond number two. It's, it's stormed and it's raining, but that's our little rain never hurt us. We're going to start off with the frog here. Come the frog here. I've never fished at this one before. So we'll see what's going on here. The storm's about to pass over. This actually looks like there might be some fish in there. Oh, 
all the water. I don't know. There used to be a mall here, so they got rid of the mall. I don't know if there's fish in here or not. Looks like there should be fish. All right, I'm still in the same spot. I just went and got my other pole. I'm going to take both of them with me. The one that has a little spinner with a rage, rage swimmer on it. I took the skirt off, so we'll see how that works. Like I said, I don't know if there's fish in here. I've never been here. I've lived in St. Augustine since 1995. I've never been to this. Because there used to be a mall here, and they just recently tore it down. So there's access to this pond now. <laughs> well, I don't know if there's actually access, but it's a Sunday, and I'm able to get to it, so... I don't see how there's not fish in here. Still ringing. I really find it hard to believe it's not fishing here. All right, I think I'm going to try to put something else on. All right, guys, I still have the frog on my other pole, but I went ahead and switched to a chatterbait. Um, I, I find it hard to believe there's no fish in this pond, but I didn't really like that other spinner bait, how that one was looking, so I got to go with the old chatter. Again, I find it hard to believe there's no fish in here. This has been here forever.
well, it started raining again, so. I don't think this thing is that deep. Looks like the place to be is on the other side, which I can't get to. <laughs> yeah. I haven't seen anything move or jump, so. This might not have been a, there might not have been any fish on this thing at all. That sucks this big body of water and there'll be no fish in it. Alright guys, so there are fish out here. I've seen a bunch of them. There's a bass right there. Well, it's a, I don't know, that might be a bluegill. I probably need to go get my glasses. I see a whole bunch of bait fish. Oh, I see a couple of big bass right there. Oh yeah, there's a couple. They see me though. Man, they don't want to commit. They're following, but they don't want to come at. It's probably because they see me. There are fish out here. But they see me, they followed me up. There's two nice sized bass that followed me up. Followed my chatterbait up.
All right, guys, I found some bass. They're not hitting nothing. So I went back to the old reliable super fluke. You guys know that I'm, if I'm not catching all my other things, I'm going to try this because I usually catch something on super fluke. So I went and bought some more white pearl. This is my favorite color. So my battery is getting, getting low. So I'm going to hit you up once I get there. All right. I don't see how I don't catch anything with this. This is usually my go-to lure to see if fish is in a pond. And the fact I've already seen a couple of bass, I know there are. But they're not being active, so I'm gonna have to make them active. Got him. Oh yeah, got him. Oh yeah, he's a nice one. Oh, he's a nice one, guys. Oh yeah, stay pinned, stay pinned, stay pinned. He's a nice one. Oh, he's a nice one. Oh yeah. There we go. Yeah. I got my scale, we're gonna weigh him. Look at that beauty. All right, let's see how big this one is. I'll get back to you. All right, guys, two and a half pounder, not bad. It's hard doing it when you're by yourself. And my battery's about to die. Hidden location. Got him. Number two. Number two. Ooh, he swallowed it too. He swallowed it. It's a little one. I got another one. I was trying to get it before my battery died. Oh, and he just broke off. He just broke off. That was number four and my battery was dying. 